Зачем нужен кандидат наук? Нет, Сразу все духа, равно надо. давайте, будь оппонировать. Ну, а по правилам можно кандидат? Потому что мы были в том совете, только что с Антоном, mm -hmm. ни авторефератов не раздали. Не ручат, ничего. Знаете, как я, я нервничаю, что заключение теперь ищут? Я там уже... Или они даст соврать, да. весь кабинет перевернул. Не, ну вот я вам точно же его привозил. Вы, вот, я вам скажу больше, что вы привозили. Я вместе до Светланы так, пишу, что они меня и прошу пишем, их да? забрать. Да. Так что... Ну, вот там какие-то отдали, какие-то... Ну, это просто позже привозили, а так, я потом что вам расскажу. Наверное, не буду уже отвечать. Ладно, давайте. Ladies and gentlemen, we are open meeting for the dissertation council FM, FBMF 1515 dedicated to the thesis defense of Kik Saoli okay, uh, on the topic investigation of locally acting drug delivery using metal organic frameworks particles. То есть исследование доставки локально действующих лекарств с помощью металлогранических частиц. Submitted for the degree of candidate of biologic, biological sciences in the specialty 152 biophysics. Uh, the council includes, includes uh, chairman of the dissertation council, <coughs> doctor of physical mathematical sciences Shankarov Zaharaledovich, deputy chairman of the dissertation council, doctor of biological sciences Yefimov Anton Evgenievich, council members, doctor of chemical sciences Dmitry Alexandrovich Gorin, Доктор биологических сайенсов из Елизавета Валерьевна Кудан, кандидат в физику и математику сайенсов Дмитрий Владимирович Клинов, и кандидат в физику и математику сайенсов Михаил Валерьевич Зюзин. Кворум из Презент. Лид организация Федеральный ресурс центр Пушкин Сантифик центр по биологическому ресурсу Оверашн Академии оф сайенсов. Институт оф сел биофизикс Оверашн Академии оф сайенсов. Сантифик супервайзер Михаил Дурманов. PhD, Deputy Head of the Special Cell Technology Lab, Moscow Institute of Physics and Technology, State University. I give the floor to the scientific secretary. So, the applicant provided the following document. Thesis published in October 19, 20, uh, 2023. Borrowed text, uh, text borrowing test report. Uh, synopsis published in October 27, 2023. A review of this supervisor. Mikhail Dremanov, a PhD, deputy head of the Special Cell Technology Lab, Moscow Institute of Physics and Technology, State University. Uh, conclusion of the <coughs> organization where the approbation was carried out. Federal State Automotive Education Institute of Higher Education, Moscow Institute of Physics and Technology, National Research University. Review one, uh, Andrei Rosenhunt, uh, doc Doctor of Biological Science, leading research of Institute of Gene Biology of Russian Academy of Science uh, and Lumnos of Moscow State University. Review two, Yuri Efremov, candidate of Biological Science, head of the Department of Modern Biomaterials, uh, Institute for Regenerative Me Medicines, Biomedical Science and Technology Park, uh, uh, First, uh, Moscow State in Medical University of the Ministry of Health of the Russian Federation. Uh, master degree, Federal State Automotive Education Institute of Higher Education, Moscow Institute of Physical and Technology, National Research University. Uh, candidate examination, foreign language good, history and philosophy of science, uh, physical and mathematical science excellent, uh, biophysics good. The document they are submitted and published on the MIPT website on time and complete this uh, requirement of the regulation of the award of academic degree of candidate science, doctor of science at MIPT. Uh, uh, accepted for defense by protocol. Protocol of uh, accepted for protection. Uh, voting minutes of the expert council for the biological science of the uh, uh, attestation com commission of MAPT number B uh, 2023 uh, 40 date October uh, 27th uh, 2023 the applicant for a scientific degree set out the essence and main provision of the dissertation uh, you can speak about your thesis. Uh, good afternoon, thank you for all coming. 
I'm going to talk about uh, investigation of locally active <coughs> drug delivery using metal organic removal particles. Locally active drug formulations are designed for injection to the tactile tissue to reduce the systemic absorption and unwanted um, effects. Uh, drug delivery systems with local administration can provide different uh, beneficials. For example, uh, localized uh, high uh, localized uh, high concentration and uh, can provide controlled drug release. Uh, also, can provide uh, long term therapeutic concentration. <coughs> My <coughs> organic framework as a promising drug delivery system <coughs> is a subclass of the coordination polymer uh, formed by self assembler, metal RNA, and uh, organic ligands. As shown here, uh, we can explain the by these four levels. Uh, this material exhibits different advantages, uh, including high porosity and uh, uh, drug loading capability, uh, easy surface multiplication and faster internalization kinetics, as well as they are biocompatible and biodegradable. Also, they can provide controlled drug release. So all these uh, unique characteristics make them um, particularly attractive in biomedical applications especially in uh, antibacterial therapy and any cancer products. Uh, here, we aim to study the feasibility of using MOVE uh, for delivery of locally acting agents for two specific <coughs> applications. As shown here, um, the first part for the anti-chlamydia infections and uh, another approach for <coughs> delivery of radionuclides for intratumoral radiotherapy. Uh, for the anticlamidia therapy, the first part, we <coughs> studied to uptake and the uh, ability of these particles to localization chlamydia incurrence. Also investigate the feasibility of the therapeutic effect. Uh, for the uh, second part, we use uh, metal organic framework as a delivery system for each humanity. Uh, <coughs> for intratumoral <coughs> radiotherapy and uh, investigate the uh, the method to in, uh, to incorporate each remnant into these mold structures and uh, study the particle penetration and the cytotoxicity uh, effects of the spheroids. Um, after that, we use the four therapeutic effects uh, to um, evaluate uh, the inhibit gross media growth factor. Clamidia. <coughs> So comedines is an obligate intracellular bacteria, uh, which is uh, which exhibit a unique uh, biophysical life cycle uh, with infectious <coughs> elementary bodies and uh, replicative or reticular bodies. The main problem for treating this uh, chlamydia infection is that they can transform a metabolically inactive persistent form, which we call the aberrant uh, RB. Mm. So here we expected that uh, uh, using metal organic more work to deliver a photosynthesizer because there are a lot of uh, different uh, uh, mold structures here we select male 100 because they are biocompatible and biodegradable also multiple drugs can be loaded into the pore of this structure uh, here we select uh, photosynthesizer <coughs> because the therapeutic effects caused by this photosynthesizer it may damage the metabolic, I mean this part, the metabolically infected persistent form of chlamydia. Uh, we, uh, we, ex we expected that this particle loaded with methane blue uh, could be um, internalized by infected uh, cells and uh, could reach the chlamydia incurring. Uh, with the light irradiation of these cells, the released um, uh, photosynthesizer can generate uh, reactive oxygen species uh, result in the cell, uh, the uh, chlamydia dies. Uh, the particles were synthesized and catalogued uh, actually by our uh, collaborators, uh, and uh, they used different methods to uh, uh, analysis the physiochemical properties. Uh, upon uh, analysis of these properties, uh, it showed that these particles uh, have an average uh, have a uh, uh, have an average around uh, uh, nine six, uh, uh, 60 nanometer. Also, the crystal structure 
uh, crystal structure part and uh, main characteristic things uh, stable some uh, some stability also confirmed by this method. <coughs> And the formulations as well as pathogens, uh, they uh, enter microfids by photo, uh, by uh, cyto, uh, by into uh, cytic rules. So we investigated the cellular uptake rate and uh, intracellular communication. This part in non affected uh, raw microfids. We observed that these particles were quickly uh, internalized and uh, can. Um, accumulated in acidic compartment of cells. Uh, here we use the TM, mm, um, e, uh, TM EPX uh, to evaluate uh, the intracellular interaction uh, between particles and the chlamydia. Uh, we found that chlamydia can um, get rich, sorry, uh, particles can get rich chlamydia occurrence and uh, after analysis of uh, T, uh, after using EBX analysis of TM image, we found that um, in the uh, compartment with uh, local with the localized uh, chlamydia part, uh, uh, there there are uh, iron uh, the iron uh, impressing of this compartment with localized uh, chlamydia. Uh, for evaluation uh, intrinsic and bacteria uh, <coughs> activity, we add more particles uh, together with uh, chlamydia during infection and uh, carried out reinfection uh, with HeLa cells. We found that uh, m more particles uh, exhibit antibacterial effects. And uh, uh, there are uh, and we can see that a significant uh, reduction in the chlamydia uh, in the chlamydia uh, titer. We carry out a release profile in different formulations. Um, we found that this, uh, uh, it, we, we didn't find a significant release in the midfield water, but a significant release, a significant uh, increase. Uh, in the different uh, uh, different uh, uh, physical uh, solutions, uh, probably um, because the presence of uh, phosphate or other uh, organic uh, uh, acid, uh, we hypothesized that the AM-based MOF particles uh, can improve the uh, generation of reactive oxygen species. Uh, so we use this star H two D C F C A to detect the uh, reactive oxygen uh, species generation. We found that uh, at the same time incubation of uh, iron's uh, more particles and free methane blue, uh, it can result in one point five uh, um, increase in the uh, RS generation. Uh, so we. Uh, we, we confirmed that this AM based more particles could enhance the photodynamic therapy. All the uh, concentrations of male 100 uh, loaded with methane blue is non uh, toxic for our host cells. To evaluate the photodynamic therapy of methane blue loaded <coughs> particles, we carried out a reinfection assay. Uh, here we add the particles uh, after uh, post injection. We found that the methylene blue loaded uh, particles uh, they can significantly reduce the chlamydia titer, and uh, the light irradiation could significantly increase the uh, antibacterial therapy compared with uh, free methylene blue or like embedded male 100 uh, particles. Uh, as for the second part, uh, we uh, investigated the feasibility using metal uh, using MOC particles uh, for delivery of e germinating for intratumor radiation therapy, also called break therapy. <coughs> uh, uh, break therapy is a gold standard therapy for multiple cancers. Um, here we select uh, uh, MOC particle as a carrier for delivery of radionuclides. That's because these particles uh, are biodegradable. 
Also, uh, the porous structure of these uh, particles uh, in OPU2 uh, encapsulate uh, uh, different uh, antithelices uh, for achieving uh, combi combined treatment. Uh, Eutrominante is a commonly used uh, radioactive uh, uh, isotopes in medicine. Uh, he, uh, here you can see he is a pure beta uh, emitter and uh, um, with, a short, with a short term of half-life. Uh, the emitted particles um, have a maximum tissue penetration around 11. So we uh, select this uh, um, isotopes, encapsulate, uh, uh, incorporated into morphic structures uh, and used for intratumoral therapy. Uh, all these uh, particles were synthesized and captured by our collaborator. They also confirmed the crystal structure, uh, main characteristic peaks, and uh, the successful age of dotting. We used the HM88 to carry out the release profile uh, for tracking bow uh, uh, distribution for HM8. We found that we actually we didn't find that there are uh, quickly read release from all these uh, solutions. For the another particle, HM based BPC morphs. Uh, we also confirmed the like, uh, like the morphology uh, mm, with, uh, uh, with a lot like morphology shape and uh, its uh, uh, micro particles. Uh, also confirmed the crystal, uh, crystal structure and uh, the main component element. Uh, the same part we carried out the release profile in the uh, different solvents. Uh, also, we just observed a very low rate of release from these solutions. Uh, compared to uh, compared to uh, monolayer, uh, compared to monolayer uh, cell culture, uh, three dimensional uh, three dimensional uh, tumor uh, spheroids can uh, provide a more accurate uh, a more accurate representation of uh, like a tumor uh, microenvironment. Also, they are uh, more uh, resistant to therapeutics. So we use the uh, uh, three dimensional long tumor. Spheroids uh, for uh, further uh, particle penetration and uh, like uh, cytotoxicity dose uh, evaluation. Uh, as you can see, we generated the uniform spheroids with the spherical shape, and uh, they can overexpress uh, some component uh, extracellular uh, uh, part, and also they over they overexpress uh, like the enzymes uh, for resistant uh, drugs. Using uh, long tumor spheroids, we didn't observe, or we can see, we just observe very low penetration for these particles. So uh, we expected that uh, after, in this case, uh, after intratumoral injection, our like atrium particle, uh, uh, no, uh, defi no diffusion or like washout of these particles uh, were observed. We carried out the uh, we, we carried out the cytotoxic uh, um, different dose using long tumor spheroids. We observed that when the dose over their point of four a micro per per well uh, will result in fifty percent of cell deaths. Uh, in this study, we used HM88, uh, stopped uh, MIL100 particles to investigate uh, tumor rotation of uh, HM88 uh, to predict uh, HM90. <coughs> we found that uh, all injected uh, percent uh, all the percentage of rejected uh, dose uh, per gram of tissue, we uh, observed that uh, most of uh, most of uh, each room were retained in tumor <coughs> size. For the each um, BTC moves, uh, we uh, added another two time points, uh, day seven and uh, uh, day 18. As uh, we can see, uh, there are still uh, relatively high injected dose retained in the tumor after seconds. <coughs> 
uh, also we observed that when each room has a component of uh, moths, they won't wash the out from tumor tissue very quickly, as you can see the red part. Uh, using CT to confirm the, uh, tum the tumor mutation of these particles, we, as you can uh, as you show with this arrow, the density of the injected uh, particles were uh, returned inside the tumor. This is a counterpart. For the uh, uh, for the uh, inhibition of these uh, particles to uh, melanoma tumor spheroids, we carried out at a different dose. We found that uh, at the dose uh, 20 microcurry per uh, milliliter, they will result in <coughs> the uh, highest cytotoxicity. Uh, for the therapeutic efficacy in vitro, we found that uh, our particles can uh, significantly uh, inhibit the growth uh, of the tumor and uh, increase the tumor survival, combat control. According to the HE uh, images, uh, the image, image we did actually we didn't find any uh, alter, alteration for our uh, our uh, our particle for the healthy tissues. So we get the conclusion that uh, um, more <coughs> particles can be used a successful uh, drug delivery system for phosphatidylic. Uh, Chlamydia uh, uh, infections uh, and with improved uh, therapeutic effects, uh, as well as it can also work as a biodegradable uh, delivery system for uh, radionuclides uh, to achieve uh, radiotherapy. And also here, I want to express <coughs> uh, my scientific supervisor, Dr. Mihai Yu, to my note. He helped uh, me a lot and he teaches me a lot of something. Also, I would like to uh, uh, um, uh, express my uh, gratitude to, for all of you. You give me uh, like a lot of useful comments for my uh, research work and uh, for my presentation, for my uh, like a future like a future experiment probably. <coughs> Yeah. Dear members of the dissertation council, writing conclusion on the content of the dissertation has been published on the MAPT website. Uh, all sequent review are positive. I ask your permission to read uh, only out the only question and comment from the review of member on the dissertation council. Okay, yes, I'm super rich. What? Oh, I to read <coughs> Shinkariot Nakharalevich, I am a uh, certification council doctor of physical and mathematical science, professor of the Russian Academy of Science, uh, 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 chief researcher of the Laboratory of Structure Biology of Iron, Iron China, uh, Federal State Budget Institute of Science, uh, Institute of Bioorganic Chemistry, named uh, after academician Shumyakin and Avchinikov, Russian Academy of Science. Uh, deep uh, head of uh, the Department of Physical Chemical Biology and Biotechnology Federal State Autonomous Education Institution of Higher Education Moscow Institute of Physics and Technology National Research University. Uh, I ask you several questions. Uh, very nice work, uh, thank you for presentation. But uh, I would like uh, to ask the some uh, minuses of your work. Sure. And uh, the first uh, question, and you don't show in your thesis and in your dissertation the chemical structure chemical structure of these uh, MOV particles and uh, it's, uh, <coughs> it's not clear how the uh, ions are hold within this particle and how they are released from this particle mm -hmm. these particles that you use two types of particles mm -hmm. I, I, I show you here because This is the first particle we used for the epidemia. The this is the structure part. So 
it will like uh, here. It has uh, like a organic part and the end part. They first coordinated together, formed the second bin, uh, building unit. After that, uh, they like uh, uh, using legging bridging from the inner framework structure. Then they will form like like the form the morphology like our particles, or we can call it as more. Mm -hmm. And uh, please, uh, the second question about these particles also. What what the size of this? Uh, this size. Size of this. Uh, uh, here, the size is around uh, nan. Uh, it's size of nanoparticles, which uh, assembled from this. Uh, please show previous slide. Okay. You you have uh, this uh, on the left. You have uh, particles of uh, <coughs> MIL, one hundred. And it's assembled in, into the same. Na Actually, the same. I just want to show the whole structure. This is the particle, and we just uh, like. Uh, uh, this, 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 this particle is made from several such uh, particles, or not? No, 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 no. It's just one particle. This, this, this yeah, they, they form the same like morphology like this. This is a morphology. Uh, our particle, the morphology is this one. This mm -hmm. is our particle, and this is the morphology. Okay. Yeah. And the size is about. Uh, show next slide, please. Yes. Uh, here. Okay. About uh, sixty nanometers. But uh, I would like also uh, ask the second, uh, third question: Why the sizes of these particles are different by SIM and DLS data? Ah, you mean this mm -hmm. one? Yeah, th that's because uh, for the this this image, the deep image is uh, got from DLS detection, but the DLS actually is. Uh, it, 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 it's uh, it's a uh, uh, indirect uh, method to detect the diameter. It means it will be like including like some water water corona around the particles. Also, our particle, if it's easily like uh, aggregate, then you will get the big or the uh, broad peak around this part. But for the SVM or TM, they are direct method. So it means that you just uh, photograph these particles and uh, you calculate uh, by yourself like this. So. Th that means the particles got from this image is smaller than that one. And uh, in this electronic uh, image, the particle are dehydrated, and uh, they are covered by some dye, or how they contrast uh, contrasted on this uh, on this electronic image? Uh, actually, they are, they are not uh, like destroyed. We we just like uh, after we uh, synthesized this particle. Then we just uh, using incubation with the methane blue, I mean the photosynthetic solution and the particle uh, suspension together for several hours or like uh, for several No, no, no. Hours. I ask you how you prepare this, uh, this, this sample for the electronic microscopy. Ah, uh, before we carry <coughs> on the experiment, uh, we will just uh, use in like uh, uh, air, the, 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 the air, um, sorry, the component are for air solution and uh, we use uh, uh, the another uh, uh, the acid is called uh, uh, transmit acid together. Then we like uh, uh, synthesize them at the um, uh, room temperature for twenty four hours, and uh, we just uh, uh, using like a centrifugation uh, got these particles. Mm -hmm. Is uh, this uh, particles have additional dye or? No, uh, no, for no, contrast. No, no, no additional dye. For the dye, we just loaded the. No, 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 no. It's, it's okay. And the uh, other question about these particles uh, when you <coughs> uh, mm, prepare the particles which contain dye inside this, you first uh, do the uh, ultrasonic incubation. And uh, why you need this sanitation for, for preparation of this? Because this part is easily aggregated, so before we carry out, we need to sanitate to uh, to just avoid the aggregation and uh, re, uh, let them uh, you know, re disperse into the solution. Okay, but uh, your thesis does not uh, describe the details of this experiment uh, and what uh, equipment you use for this uh, sanitation. You use the ultrasonic heater, just the sonic heater with the low. Uh, ultrasonic bath. Yes, yes, uh, okay. correct. And, and about uh, the second type of particles, uh, well, what was the chemistry well, was uh, in the second case? Uh, you mean this part or the no, this, 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 this part? Yes. Yeah, actually this part uh, uh, being uh, synthesized by our collaborator and uh, we, uh, there are some like uh, uh, previous studies also like 
proved that the structure for this one. What's the for elements uh, of this con construct? What chem chemical the, elements? The yttrium. The yttrium. Yttrium you used to put to put inside the particles, but what uh, the particles formed uh, without no. yttrium? So, so, sorry, Professor. Here is not just informed. Here we synthesize this particle just like. Uh, Yttrium as a uh, as a iron part and this BTC and this acid as an organic part mm -hmm. without the incorporation. They just form the mold. Okay. And uh, this uh, synthesis was done by your collaborator. But who synthesized uh, the first type of particle for, for you? Uh, the first type of uh, MIL 100. Who, who, who did this synthesis? Ah, uh, you mean this one? Yes. Also, our it's collaborator. <coughs> yeah. No, no. All, all, all these particles are provided by our collaborator. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, the second uh, bunch of questions about uh, the radioactivity. Uh, you use uh, two types of isotopes. One is uh, yttrium-1988 and one is yttrium-90. Uh, mm, to detect the... 88 nuclear, you use uh, gamma culture yes, uh, be right. because it's uh, decay that, uh, that uh, pro provide gamma uh, quantum, but yttrium 90 decay usual, uh, as was shown on your slide, by usual better decay, yes. and how you calculate the uh, decay in this case, how you measure radioactivity for the better decay. Mm -hmm. uh, Actually, uh, in this experiment, we didn't carry out uh, each ninety for the bell distribution. We just carry out each uh, eighty eight dot uh, mock particles. We use this mod, uh, this uh, particle just uh, uh, we mentioned because this particle is easier determined, uh, de <coughs> uh, easier determined, and also uh, it can help us to predict how this. Yttrium, I mean, yttrium-19, radioactive part. Uh, you mean what this, uh, uh, on the p picture B, it's a prediction? Yeah, you're it's right. It's not measurement. Yes, yes, we, c we, 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 we made this plot. Oh, it's about this part, calculate uh, by decay, yttrium-19. Uh -huh. We are not an uh, experiment. Okay, I understand, but uh, I would like to uh, ask why you use uh, yttrium-90 <coughs> for long-day measurements, for seven days, but uh -huh. it's they, they decay very fast and... Uh, uh, the all was shown here is also a prediction. Yeah. Yes? Yes. It's not clear from your dissertation. Oh, sorry. <laughs> uh -huh. And the uh, last question about uh, the, uh, why you use two types of uh, tumors for different uh, uh, particles. Uh, f f <coughs> for each of particle, uh, you use uh, different type of tumor. Ah. Uh, Actually, initially we started work with uh, yttrium uh, dot mu hundred and with the lung tumor uh, uh, to carry out our experiment. Uh, but we found that the uh, tumor established is not successful. So we changed, we switched to uh, this particle. I mean, the yttrium based because we found that the yttrium th these particles they with long term biological uh, profile. So we changed this particle and it carried out another cell line, another tumor to uh, finish our experiment <coughs> to prove our content. What was wrong with the first set of experiments? The particle biodegrade very fast or the tumor was the, not the tumor. sensitive to the mm. particles? Actually, we use uh, like uh, 10 million uh, cells for each tumor. But we found that 10 days later, just uh, some tumors <coughs> appeared. But uh, for the another models, they don't uh, appear. So that's why we changed it. Uh, you mean that uh, the particles was in ineffective? Uh, they don't no, kill. Only for the tumor. The don't, don't kill the tumor. No, the tumor is not uh, well established. Ah, no, no, not for it. Yes. You didn't make the steroids. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. That's, that's all. Uh, Efimov Artem Evgenievich, Doctor of Biological Science, uh, Chef Researcher, Laboratory of Biomimetechnology, Federal State Digital Institute, National Medical Research Center for Transportation of Artificial Organs, named after Kremlin Shumakov and all the 
Ministry of Health of the Russian Federation. I want to check. Uh, please give me, uh, please give me more methodic uh, details about team and these uh, measurements, which you used in the dissertation work. <coughs> you mean this one? Can you answer this? Yeah. Yes. Um, then actually, this image, uh, this image we got from PM uh, EDX image because this is um, um, this technology. Uh, this technique is uh, electron uh, uh, spectroscopy. It's uh, combined with uh, PM image and uh, EDX uh, uh, analysis. Uh, for elemental, uh, all like uh, quality, uh, quality, uh, qualitative uh, detection. Um, here we use the uh, to uh, try this part and in this compartment. This compartment includes the chlamydia and. Uh, Probably this is a particle, so and we are not sure. So we use the, this method to analyze this part. We found that there are pairs, uh, the air. So it means in this compartment, our uh, this air is from our particle. Then it's colloquialized uh, chlamydia. Mm -hmm. It showed that uh, probably uh, our particle is uh, uh, a promising deliver part for tracking uh, in, uh, chlamydia inquiry. Mm -hmm. And uh, do you know which which model of microscope was used? Uh, I, um, I, I don't know this part. Mm -hmm. this so it was done in uh, <coughs> Moscow State University. Yes. Yeah, but mm -hmm. I forgot mm -hmm. to ask this part. Sorry. Okay. Uh, Goran Dmitry Alexandrovich, Doctor of Chemical Science, Professor of Central Photonic and Photonic Technology. Uh, the most non profit education organization of higher education of Hokkaido Institute of Science and Technology. Okay, thank you. I can do it by myself. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. Could you show? I have additional questions. <coughs> Could you show, uh, show the slide number eighteen? Number eighteen. Mm -hmm. And uh, why do you have a different release uh, for PBS buffer and uh, for uh, FBS? You see, you have. Uh, different magnitude yeah mm -hmm. different magnitude of release do you have explanation because the difference between pbs and fbs not so big what's uh -huh. the difference yeah Why? Uh, yeah here we we, we observed that the release profile <coughs> in pbs is lower than the fbs uh, probably because uh, yttrium in the pbs uh, be as a component of uh, yttrium uh, oxidant because uh, yttrium oxygen is uh, uh, it is then the dissolved uh, in the solution, mm -hmm. that's why it, it uh, holds the lower release. Okay, and a second uh, question to the slide number twenty. Twenty. Yes. Yeah. <coughs> could you exp explain how uh, how uh, did you prepare this three D spheroids? Uh, uh, for this part, mm -hmm. we use a mold we got from in, in like. A I can say it's online. It's a commercial commercial mode. This commercial mode, we just uh, with different hole and with different size. So we use uh, this mode to generate uh, our uh, spheroid because in this route, in this mode, we can got a uniform and and in the size a uniform spheroids and with a spherical uh, shape. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. And the next question. Related to the stability of MOF structure and different uh, buffers, for example, PBS, uh, cell media, and so on. Uh, do you have this uh, data? Uh, yeah, this yeah. one. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, and release also, yeah. Uh, yeah, here uh, we um, observe the different release profile, the different uh, solution. Mm -hmm. um, uh, the, main, the, the main reason is because <coughs> of uh, um, the uh, the profit, I mean, in profit, uh, it's probably in this solution, it includes some profit group and uh, like some other um, organic acid because this acid can compete, can compete uh, iron with uh, carboxylic group we used. And also uh, in <coughs> FBS, it should a lower release compared to like FBS or others. Uh, because uh, 
uh, sorry, in hypersin, it's very low because the, the hypersin is uh, more weaker, more weak acid. So that's why he released the, uh, not, not so fast. But uh, for FDS, it's uh, like a, a strong acid, so it will release first. Uh, in the like uh, uh, FDS part, FDS part, the um, um, they will form the, the like a protein corner around the particle. Then this corner will protect uh, these particles to uh, uh, from some attaching like a phosphate part. Okay, thank you so much. And the last question related to uh, viability, yeah, mm -hmm. with radiation and without radiation, yeah. Why do we have uh, any difference uh, with light and without light? It's not significant. <coughs> For example, for free uh, mes methylene blue, uh -huh. we don't see difference. Do you uh -huh. have explanation for this? Oh, actually, this experiment is for select the dose. It, it's ah, okay. non-toxic for our host cells. Ah, I see. I see. I understand now. Okay. Thank you so much. Yeah. Other questions are <coughs> mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you. Куда Елизавета Валерьевна, доктор Biological Science, leading expert of the scientific project, scientific and educational center of biomedical engineering, Federal State of Tomorrow Education Institute of Higher Education, National Research Technological University, NCIS. Uh, in my perspective, the thesis lack uh, sufficient uh, that that and uh, in uh, addressing issue related to drug release uh, uh, curves and uh, different physiological solvents. For instance, uh, there are no burst release on all the drug and habits, unlike in other solutions. Uh, what could you be a reason for this lack uh, of uh, burst release uh, in the habit solution and what factor may might be a contribution to it? Actually, it's almost the same part, but it's different from release profile. Uh, for the stability of these uh, particles, actually, we didn't decode out of this. Uh, there are a multiple studies they carried out this part. Uh, for example, our collaborators, they, they uh, studied this part. And uh, the main reason for uh, to affect the stability of these particles it also uh, depends on the like uh, the basic group or like uh, some <coughs> organic acid. They can compete with uh, they can compete with uh, 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 carb carboxylic groups uh, for iron coordination. And also, it will relate to the uh, different concentrations. It we if it with if we use a higher concentration for these. Uh, Solutions with like uh, uh, phosphate or like other acid groups, uh, they will just uh, uh, decompose very quickly. Okay. okay. Uh, second question: I'm uh, in interested in understanding the rationale behind the opening open for different uh, experimental design to assess and with the cytotoxicity in 3D models. Uh, a a uh, 549 steroid were generated in micro modes and then transferred in non attachment plates. Where B16F1 steroid were initially formed in low additive plates. What influenced the choice of those uh, distinct approaches? Uh, actually, we chose uh, different. Uh, uh, Different uh, um, materials to formulate to formulate our uh, viewers <coughs> because A five four nine these cells uh, they uh, can't grow like uh, over two hundred micrometers in the plate, but for B sixty F one this cell line they can grow uh, uh, very fast and can form a big uh, spheroids uh, even uh, reach like uh, one thousand uh, micrometers. Okay. Uh, Klin of Dmitry Vladimirovich, candidate of physical and mathematical science, uh, head of laboratory, laboratory of medical and technology, Federal State Detroit Institute, uh, Federal Scientific and Clinical Center for Physical and Chemical Medicine, named after Academic Lapulchin, Federal Medical Biological Agency. Uh, okay. Uh, what causes the <coughs> Discrepancies uh, between 
da, diferența electron microscopy and delays da, date uh, for nanoparticles MIL uh, 100. He's so already answered, but uh, maybe <laughs> some questions about environments. Why reason to very big environments <coughs> near the particles? You could you comment? Some comment? Not this, but when where the scanning electron microscopy data, the less data <coughs> and so oh. concerning the, the first part. Yes, yes. The first part. Like this. Yeah, yeah this one. Uh -huh. And the difference between this uh, method for uh, measured uh, particle size um, for the DLS, um, this technique they uh, used for uh, measurement the particles uh, for hydrodynamic diameter. Hydrodynamic yes. diameter, this part. Uh, also, it's uh, depends on your particles uh, like uh, uniform. If it's not uniform, if <coughs> just against one big particles, it will increase the uh, uh, um, uh, the size of these particles. But actually, if you consider the environment of the particles, you should obtain uh, uh, more bigger diameter for DLS than rather than scanning elect electron microscopy. It's true? Or uh, no? What do you think? About? Actually, it depends on uh, your particles. If your particle with a spherical shape, actually, it's better than this method. Because this one, is, uh, it's better for the... Uh, like, uh, the but you have uh, mean size. Yeah. It means that uh, no problem with the shape, rather with only environment of the particles. Mm -hmm. You know? Yeah, you're right. Actually, this the, the, this image, uh, this uh, <coughs> technique is more easy than this one for the particle size. You're right. Okay. Another question. Uh, some date, for example, on page uh, 55, 56, uh, given the success of significant digits calculated uh, bit rare. Yes, uh, so questions about uh, uh, precision of your experiments and data that you uh, have and you uh, demonstrated. Yeah, Could you comment? It? What, what's the precision <coughs> of this data? Uh, you mean this part? Mm, not this, well, I, but uh, I, I, for example, page... Uh, just a moment. Uh, page. Uh, там написано в комментариях этой страницы. Нет, не написано. Сейчас, just a moment. А, вот. 56, for example. Okay. You have yeah, many, many part, digitals, yeah. and uh, I don't <coughs> understand what's the precision of this experiment. Yeah, actually, because uh, uh, the <laughs> you have you're right, you're right. My, my mistake, I missed the letter, so I, oh, oh, I already cracked it. Like ah, this. okay, no problem. Uh, it's a good, better, yeah. much better. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, and the and last uh, question uh, figure three. Uh, Point ah. uh, 20 show uh, it with uh, why I uh, BTC and most nanoparticles is uh, size larger than one for two, two micron. It's difficult to call such particles as nanoparticles. Yeah, you're right. And, and, and uh, another <coughs> uh, slide. Actually, that's a table. I, I, I put this one. Yeah, this, this one. is a microparticle. But question about uh, my question about how its particle can penetrate into the um, spheroids oh. and even into <coughs> the cells because the size of this particle mm, much bigger than nanoparticles, you know? Could uh, you answer? Could you some comment? It? Yes. Actually, according to the literature, the currently used uh, nano uh, carriers or like a radio for, for radio nuclides, they are bigger than this part, actually. And the shape, this shape actually is, is good for the therapeutic. Why? Because this shape, if the intratumor injection, it's uh, like uh, without uh, all, we can just see a, a, a negligible like a release from uh, or wash out from this tumor tissue. Okay.
Да. Uh, Зюзин Михаил Валерьевич, кандидат в физикал математикал сайенс, лидер ресерчер, faculty of physics, federal state, на Monash Education, Institute of Higher Education, National Research University, ИТМО. Ксиоли uh, has a performance characterization of the obtained nanomorph uh, by various methods. However, in main result, uh, 3.1.1, the obtained results uh, were not uh, discussed. Uh, reflected in the PSRD should be identified as well as peak in FTIER following by discussion on structure property of the sample. Uh, yes, here uh, PFT ID <coughs> actually is, uh, uh, can give you information about the arrangement of uh, items in the crystal uh, lattice. Uh, and it's uh, uh, normally used to detect the crystal structure. Uh, according to we uh, synthesized this part, uh, we found that the, uh, all the like, uh, main peak, uh, main characteristic peak uh, synthesized particles uh, is uh, uh, perfectly matched the simulated one. So it's to uh, confirm that our particle uh, with good <coughs> crystal structure and uh, is the one we desire to use it. Okay. Uh, I did not find the inf uh, information about added nanomorph per cell during a text studies. Why was the specific amount added? So in this experiment, actually before we carried out this, we exploited the different constitution for our particles. We, s we found that <coughs> we selected those is around five. We can see that it means this constitution for select for our uh, uh, intratumoral uh, uptake part, they are non-toxic for our host cells. So that's why we used this uh, constitution for our this experiment. Okay, what is the origin of uh, photosynthesizer properties of used nanomorph? Mm -hmm. uh, actually, here probably. Uh, um, we 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 used uh, like uh, uh, we didn't uh, explain it clearly in my dissertation. Actually, for our particle, they didn't show any like photosynthesizer <coughs> properties. We just encapsulate uh, photosynthesizer into this pore, into the pore of this structure. All this uh, photosynthesizer uh, comes from our photosynthesizer, not our particle part. It is unclear how MOF can penetrate steroid reaching porous. Uh, what is the mechanism behind? Sorry, could you repeat? Uh, it is unclear how MOF can penetrate steroid uh, reaching porous. Mm. Uh, there are two, re two mechanisms for uh, particles uh, penetrating <coughs> into steroids. Uh, uh, the first one is uh, the uh, exothelium, and uh, another one is um, about uh, it, it actually is uh, uh, intercytosic dependent because uh, the the cells, I mean the auxiliary cells from uh, steroids, they can internalize the particle and then exo um, exos uh, exocytosis them. Uh, in this case, the particles will be internalized and. Uh, and uh, exosome uh, to oxide. Uh, in this case, the particles will be uh, reset to several times. And in this case, the corner <coughs> cells, they will also internalize this particle. So that's why they can penetrate into the core in some uh, case. Okay, Mikhail Valerievich. Okay, thanks a lot. Yes. Uh, dear members of the dissertation council, also subsequent review are positive. I ask your permission to make a brief review of the following review. Okay. Okay. Conclusion of the organization, the probation was carried out. Federal State at the moment, Education Institute of Higher Education, Moscow Institute of Physical Technology, National Research University. Signed by Anna uh, Galenkova, head of Center of Education Program, PTF, School of Biological and Medical Physics, MIPT. Approved by the candidate of uh, biological science, vice rector of uh, 
science vitali bagai the dissertation uh, investigation of uh, locally acting drug delivery using metal organic framework particles исследование доставки локально действующих лекарств с помощью metal organic частиц uh, by Seoli it recommended by for the difference to obtain the degree of candidate of biological science uh, specialty 1.5.2 by physics uh, review of the leading organization. Lead organization, Federal Research Center, uh, Pushkin Scientific Center for Biological Research of the Russian Academy of Science, Institute of Cell Biophysics of the Russian Academy of Science. The leader organization is the positive uh, review seen by Novoselov uh, VI, Doctor of Biological Science, Professor, Chief Researcher of the Laboratory of Mechanism and Dose Regulation of Cellular uh, professor and uh, approved by uh, uh, director of this organization, doctor of uh, physical and mathematical science, uh, really about, uh, that the dissertation explores the uh, feasibility of using nano and micro particle buttons of uh, metal organic frameworks. Uh, for the delivery of uh, local action therapeutic agents, including for the sentinel for uh, for the dynamic uh, radiation of the chlamydia infection and radionuclides for internal radiotherapy of cancer, which are highly relevant uh, files of uh, company medicines, material science, and uh, biophysics. The Red Organization report contains uh, to, uh, no negative framework to the dissertation. Uh, the main finding, uh, confined by excellent uh, experimental work, uh, clearly formulated. Uh, the achieved result of the dissertation has been published in uh, three high impact core one uh, journals, uh, which are uh, indexed of, of by Web on Science and Scopus. Additionally, the research result. Uh, has been presented in the three domestic and uh, international conference. Uh, the presence of the scientific work means the requirement of regulation of the award of academic degree of uh, candidate of science and at MAPT. Uh, thus, uh, in the opinion of the leading organization, the dissertation work uh, of CSEOLA uh, meets uh, the requirements of the regulation of average academic degree of candidate of science, doctor of science uh, in MAPT FISTEH for the dissertation for the degree of uh, candidate of science and it's after uh, the, the average the degree of candidate biological science of MAPT on specialty uh, 1.5.2 biophysics. Feedback from leading organization does not take into account comments and questions. Excellent reviews. Uh, there are two uh, reviews on the dissertation from uh, Andre Rosenkranz, uh, uh, Doctor of Biological Science, leading researcher in the field of gene biology of Russian Academy of Science uh, and Lomonosov Moscow State University. And uh, Dr. Yuri Efremov, candidate of biological science, head of the Department of the Modern Biomaterials Institute for Regenerative Medicine, Biomedical Science and Technology Park uh, <coughs> of Sechenov, First Moscow State uh, Medical University of the Ministry of Health uh, of Russian Federation. The work is positive characteristic in this review, uh, declaring the dissertation content is performed on the high scientific level. There are following remarks in the review. Uh, it uh, remains unclear what the author means by the abbreviation uh, BTC. Even in the field of chemistry, this abbreviation uh, is used to refer different uh, substance. Uh, Apparently, uh, it's uh, benzene, one, three, five, uh, three carbolic acids. Uh, is it so? Uh, what is abbreviation uh, BTC? Uh, actually, you are right. The BTC <coughs> can like uh, uh, represent a different uh, uh, different chem chem chemicals, uh, but here we means the the BTC is uh, 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 one, uh, three, five. Uh, uh, benzene tri uh, uh, tricarboxylic uh, tri 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 acid. 
What causes the uh, 1.5 fold increase in fluorescence under DCF DA irradiation after attaching methylene blue to nanoparticles? Uh, uh, in this condition, probably it's because of the scalp quenching of, uh, of methylene blue, they are presented in this way. On the Legenton figure uh, 3.48, uh, uh, it uh, indicated that data show as, as mean as DN3. Uh, However, this such number of uh, repetitions uh, P cannot be uh, 0 0.01 in man witness testing. How many repeats were actually done? Uh, yes, you are totally right. Uh, we, we already corrected the date first. <coughs> we use the lab is three. We can reach the zero point uh, uh, zero one. We already corrected the information at this point. Okay. Paragraph uh, eight and main result and, and the outlook could have uh, be awarded better. It seems that the first three votes only uh, was an understanding. Uh, and uh, has the date uh, shown uh, figure 3.21 uh, been significantly evaluated? Uh, the last uh, statistic evaluation of this data for uh, uh, is formulated to us. Yeah. Uh, about the, uh, the, these comments, we uh, used uh, this uh, log rank text and we found uh, for our control and uh, our uh, radioisotope particles, they show <coughs> the statistic differently. But uh, for our uh, uh, stable particles, they didn't uh, show uh, any like difference from uh, control and our these particles. So it means our particle, uh, our result is valid. Okay, uh, it's time for additional questions. Uh, so one additional question, and uh, you incorporate the dye, the methylene blue, inside your nanoparticles. And what uh, expected uh, mechanism of work uh, of such particles with dye inside? The uh, when you um, lighten your tissue with this particle inside, the dye inside the <coughs> particle will, will obtain the light and generate uh, the uh, some oxygen or, or, or so some active form of oxygen and so on or dye should be uh, go first outside the particle, be in, inside the tissue, and only in this form dye should generate the uh, active form of oxygen. Actually, you are right as for the second part. Uh, uh, we, incorp we, we encapsulated this, uh, uh, this uh, methylene blue into these uh, particles after internalized. Uh, the, the particles will be decreased, will be decreased. Mm -hmm. I mean, it will, it will be uh, degraded or decomposed. Mm -hmm. And dye released in yeah, inside? Yeah, that will be released mm -hmm. inside this dye. Okay. Mm -hmm. Can I ask a brief question? Uh, yes. Hello? Can you hear me? Yes. <coughs> yes, yeah, just a very brief question to the second part of your, uh, of your presentation. Okay. Uh, could you please describe maybe in a couple of words how did you uh, labeled your mobs, your particles with radium and light, and, yeah, and how stable was uh, this labeling? Uh, you mean this part? Uh, yes, to the second part, when you use radio, radio labeled mobs. Yeah. Uh, we uh, so how did you perform radio labeling? So maybe just brief, very briefly in a couple of words. And how stable was it, uh, yeah, was uh, radio labeling? Uh, actually, uh, in this part, <coughs> we added uh, yttrium during the synthesis of these particles. Uh, so it means uh, yttrium will like uh, will use the same way like the air. They coordinate with our organic linker, and uh, they form actually yttrium uh, have uh, like uh, can have uh, like uh, six. Uh, uh, six number of coordination, just like the air, they use the same. They use the same way, and also here we use uh, the ratio about uh, uh, yttrium to air is about uh, uh, one to nine. So uh, in this ratio, we found that, uh, or less this ratio, we found that uh, yttrium dot can't 
damage the structure about uh, MIL100. But if we use higher, we will find another like uh, uh, structures. It's another uh, MOFs. It's just like HMPTC. So we select uh, the ratio less than one to nine. Then we can got the same structure with the MIL100 and without damage their crystal structure. Okay, thank you. Тогда надо Михаила позвать. Михаил, у нас онлайн? Да, да. Михаил, вы нас слышите? А, да, добрый день, я вижу и слышу. Хорошо. А меня видно, слышно? Не видно, но слышно. А, да. Ну, хорошо. Хорошо. Мы бы хотели услышать ваш отзыв. Ага, да. So I can uh, like read uh, just my uh, report uh, or just uh, say some uh, words about uh, Seoli's work. Uh, it would be more formal, I guess. So is it relevant? Okay, so uh, if so, I would like uh, to say that uh, this is a great pleasure for me uh, to recommend uh, Xiao Li for the PhD degree in biophysics. Uh, Xiao Li uh, yeah, was my first uh, student uh, who joined my group in uh, far uh, 2019, uh, when I started to work at MIPT. Uh, it was time when we almost had no, uh, <laughs> hadn't uh, any instrument, uh, limited amount of uh, chemicals and materials work, uh, but uh, Xiao Li's enthusiasm, uh, high level of self-organization and creativity in this stressful situation uh, significantly helped us to overcome many tough circumstances that time. Uh, during work on the dissertation, Xiao Li uh, actively participated as a speaker in uh, numerous uh, laboratory seminars. Uh, she uh, learned diverse skill set, including working with uh, primary cell cultures, uh, PCR, uh, flow cytometry, monobloating. Uh, she uh, learned how to handle with uh, radio isotopes uh, and uh, got some expertise of work uh, with uh, laboratory animals. Uh, Sally also took part uh, in three scientific conferences, uh, and uh, it should be noted that beside her project, uh, she also has been involved uh, in work on other projects. Uh, at the intersection of <coughs> biophysics and biomedical engineering. So all this uh, work uh, resulted uh, in a total uh, five published papers uh, in Q1 peer review journals, and uh, there are uh, four articles um, uh, at the moment uh, on the stage of uh, submission for revision. Uh, throughout uh, the research period, uh, Xiao Li has supervised uh, undergraduate students, uh, maintaining an enjoyable atmosphere in the lab. Uh, Xiao Li also has demonstrated herself as a responsible and independent researcher. Uh, in addition to these uh, technical aspects, uh, Xiao Li is an excellent colleague and uh, is well liked by her supervisor, <laughs> uh, peers, uh, trainees within the lab. Uh, I have an utmost confidence uh, that Xiao Li will be a strong asset uh, to her next uh, laboratory company in the future, and uh, I wish her great success in her professional journey. Uh, in my opinion, uh, Xiao Li's uh, project uh, fully aligns with the requirements for the PhD degree in biophysics uh, at, uh, at MIT, and uh, I endorse her uh, candidature uh, for a PhD degree. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, it's time for discussion, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Colleagues, uh, someone w would like to say several words <coughs> about the dissertation? Okay, I, I agree with the uh, supervisor and I would like to support this work uh, because uh, you see that uh, our candidate uh, demonstrates uh, uh, many uh, many skills, uh, knowledge, and so on. She answered all the questions, and therefore, my opinion is that it would be nice to support her for future for her future career. Yeah. Okay, I agree with that. 
I also uh, would like to set several words. It's very interesting work. It's uh, very nice to see this work here on our council. Uh, <coughs> I have um, very good uh, imagination uh, feeling when I read this work. It's very interesting for me. And I also would like to support this work in defense of the Xiaoli in and uh, wish her good luck for uh, her future work in uh, other laboratories and so on. Okay, uh, everybody. Uh, yes, I agree with my colleagues. Uh, okay, okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, it's time for your conclusion. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, uh, final words. Final words. Yes, yeah, yeah, true. Yes, actually, I, I'm so happy just to come here uh, to finish uh, actually my, my, my <coughs> whole part about my PhD research with these four years. Actually, it's amazing and even though it's so stuff, but uh, I coded and uh, with a lot of help from my scientific supervisor. And also like uh, all fans here, they give me a lot of uh, like support. Also, I also want to uh, thank you for like uh, Dr. Uh, uh, Leonor, because uh, in some case I can't work uh, without uh, with, with the cells, but uh, he uh, support me to work uh, in uh, like uh, his uh, laboratory. So I'm so grateful uh, when I, I met a lot of um, nice person here. So thank you. Thank you. В общем, удалиться еще да. а, Или сначала выбираем. А, выбираем, да. а потом... Uh, now we should uh, elect, elect the... Как она называется? Counting, counting Commission. Uh, I propose to... All, all of you okay. to do this commission, because uh, we have only three person. Uh, uh, and uh, Anton, you will be a chief of the, okay. this commission. And now we ask... Uh, you and your <coughs> friends go outside and we vote for you. Ah, ah. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, who? Mm. Uh, who would like to support this decision, okay. like this decision of we this uh, mm -hmm. commission? Mm -hmm. uh, uh, we should uh, vote. Mikhail, пожалуйста, проголосуйте online. И за это тоже. Контап Миша. Михаил, поднимайте руку, что вы за комиссию счетную. Yes. Отлично. Все. Uh, so now we ask you to leave our side. We count the our votes. Uh, okay. Okay. And I ask you to return. Медицинских и биологии, я биологический же. Но я еще по ваксскому. Технических он даже может. Okay. Я сейчас соглашаю. So. Протокол на русском, на английском или на русском не вышать? So results of the uh, voting. So we had um, six all amount of ballots in six. Uh, six was uh, distributed and online uh, two bulletins and not distributed zero so results of the voting of the dissertation council about the phd degree for Cisauli for the work investigation of locally acting drug delivery using metal organic framework particles so for six votes against zero votes uh, and invalid ballots zero <coughs> So let's vote for uh, the decision of the counting committee. Yeah. Okay. okay. And, and next we vote. And next we need to vote conclusion. about uh, conclusion about the dissertation. Conclusion of dissertation council. So let's who vote. support this uh, conclusion finally? Okay. It's it's all. We congratulate you. You receive the PhD degree from uh, our institute, from our committee. Uh -huh. Okay.
Okay. What is the results of the secret vote of the members of the dissertation council? For six votes against zero votes, invalid ballot zero. We decided what the submitted dissertation work meets the requirement of the regulation on awarding academic degree degrees of candidate of science, doctor of science at MAPT, Fistech, and to award its author six only the scientific degree of candidate of biological science in the speciality one point five point two biophysics. Thank you. Thank you.